The Catholic Church has announced that priests are now able to bless same-sex couples. But the Vatican has also made it clear that such blessings cannot be given in connection with any regular ceremonies and that the church is not offering such couples any impression of a marriage. Our Shin Yeon with more. Catholic priests will now be able to bless same-sex couples. On Monday, Pope Francis approved the Declaration Fiducia Supplicants published by the Vatican's Faith Department that allowed the possibility of blessings for couples in irregular situations, including unmarried couples, divorcees, and same-sex couples. People with homosexual tendencies are children of God. God loves them. God is with them. However, the Vatican made clear this is not an offering any type of ritualization or impression of a marriage. The document stated the blessing must never be given in regular ritual ceremonies, including the sacrament of marriage, mass, or a civil union, nor can it be given in connection with them. Cardinal Victor Manuel Fernandez, who signed the ruling, said it does not violate the sacrament of marriage between a man and a woman, as it does not change or modify the Church's long-standing stance on marriage. But for the first time in the Catholic Church's history, the Vatican has opened itself to same-sex couples. It follows the Pope's continued commitment to reform and indicates a change from the Vatican's position in 2021 when it refused to bless same-sex unions. In October, the Pope indicated that priests could bless same-sex couples based on their judgment. However, conservative cardinals sought clarification on whether such blessings aligned with Catholic teachings. The Pope responded by emphasizing that marriage is exclusively between a man and a woman and rituals implying in any other way should be avoided. Last Sunday, Pope Francis celebrated his 87th birthday, and according to religious experts, there is a prediction that due to his ongoing health issues in old age, he may become even more proactive in Catholic reforms. Shin Yun, Arirang News.